In today's market, denim garment designers and finishers must offer innovative products to remain competitive. At the same time, they have to keep commercialization time short and maximize their productivity in order to keep prices within a reasonable range. Current garment dry finishing technology makes this difficult. Dry finishing processes are labor-intensive with low product throughput. The number of steps involved in processing can be high, which can greatly increase costs. Fabric degradation during dry finishing can be significant, and the potential for seconds is higher than in most textile processes. Most dry finishing techniques are aimed at removing the outer core of the indigo dyed yarn to reveal the white core underneath the surface. As with wet finishing, the character of the yarn itself is the key to effective dry finishing processes. Dry finishing is usually used to create areas of abrasion or color loss that mimic what happens naturally over many wearings and home launderings. Most consumers prefer denim garments that are soft and comfortable. In other words, garments that have been aged to look and feel like something the consumer may have had for years. These aged characteristics can be achieved by dry and wet finishing techniques. In this segment, we'll discuss the manual techniques used to create such effects, such as sanding, brushing, scraping or cutting, adding holes, laser effects, and other special effects.